Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel and in this video I'm going to show you how to perfect your text-to-speech voiceover with Audacity. It's pretty simple to do and I'm going to use a very cheap text-to-speech software to do this. So I use this strategy for most of my faceless YouTube channel videos I create. I don't spend so much on hiring people to be doing my voiceover for me. And let me tell you, a lot of YouTube channels you see out there use text-to-speech voice of it just as you don't see them because they've been able to make it a bit more perfect with other softwares or some other expensive text-to-speech softwares actually come with perfect voices so you can hardly differentiate between them and an original human voice now watch this video the voiceover of the video was made with a text-to-speech software that i'm going to show you right now and then i made a few tweaks on to at least make it sound better with audacity this is pretty simple you can do it trust me if you're ready let's get into it let's watch the video if you're looking to buy an expensive car but don't want to spend beyond your means here are five cheap luxury cars you'll love. These cars have everything you could ask for in luxury vehicles, like leather seats, surround sound, and more, all at affordable prices that won't break the bank. 1. What makes an expensive car expensive? Expensive cars are typically priced between $60,000 and $200,000. There's a lot that goes into determining how much a car costs, so we've created a handy list of things you should consider before dropping six figures on your next ride. When shopping for your dream car, take into account its MSRP, market value, and depreciation costs to make sure you really get what you pay for. For example, some luxury cars depreciate at a faster rate than others. A BMW may cost more than an Audi, but if it loses half its value after three years, it may not be worth it in the long run. Be sure to do your research. So what do you think about the video I just showed you? I think it's pretty good, right? Especially the voiceover. And that's exactly what I'm going to show you today. Show you how to, I mean, get this voiceover and make it perfect. I do this myself. Almost all my new faceless channels use this approach. You can try it too. That's the speech software you're going to use. It's called Voicely. Voicely is a pretty cheap text-to-speech software. If I say it's pretty cheap, what I mean is it's not too expensive. It's, it's for just one-time payment and you are free to go. You don't have to subscribe and be paying every month. The other thing about it is that it combines about four text-to-speech engines into this one text-to-speech software. These engines include Amazon Poly, Microsoft Azure, Google Cloud text-to-speech, then IBM Watson. It has a lot of voices in there in about 60 languages. You can try it yourself. Get into it. Try it yourself. If you don't like it, there's a 7 days money back guarantee. I wouldn't recommend something I'm not using myself to my audience, you know. So, do well to have it if you want to do a great job. Now, let's get into it. So here is inside Voicely, the text-to-speech software we are going to use for our audio and eventually use Audacity to better it. Now within here at the right hand side, you have the languages, about 60 plus languages. And here you have the voices, both male and female. You have children voices also. Right here you have the speed, which you would want to probably reduce or increase. but the average is pretty cool and the pitch also you may decide to increase or decrease but zero is pretty okay so this is a generate button and here is a timeline we use and the create here is what you can use to create and then eventually download now let's paste our text in here by tapping ctrl v on our keyboard here you can change the language you want to use I prefer the Canadian accent, so I'm going down here to search for Canadian accent. Here you are. And now the person whose voice I want to use is not Linda. I want to try lame. And then of course I can preview the voice. 
This is a preview of my voice using good. Voicely software. So now go to generate down here. And this will take some time to generate the audio. All right, so our audio is ready. Let's listen to it. If you're looking to buy an expensive car but don't want to spend beyond your means, here are five cheap luxury cars you'll love. I think this is pretty These cool, cars right? Have everything you could Click have. on create to get it ready. It's ready now. Download and our audio is ready down here. So it is this audio we are going to better in Audacity. Pretty simple to do. So that leads us to the next step, which is adding several effects to this audio to make it a bit more better than it is now. Before we get into Audacity, Erm, um, I'm quite curious. This script is really rich. Did you write it yourself? Or hired someone to? What? Oh. What I saying? Do you think I can't write this myself? Well, anyways, you are right. Um, I didn't write the script myself. I use a software called AnyWord. It's my all-time favorite AI copywriting software. And it does all the work for me. Since I found AnyWord, all my faceless YouTube channels use it to write the scripts. Not that alone, even my blog also use this. It's pretty easy to do. I just have to log in and then go to the data driven. And this side actually generates for me titles and the descriptions of the titles for my videos and other things. And it's very, very great. Now back here, the editor also does some kind of editing for me most often when I write the script. If I want to improve the script, I just click on the content improve. If I want to further explain what I have written, I just click on explain to a fifth grader and many others but that's not exactly what i use for the script writing it was this rather blog wizard so if you go to the blog wizard simply create a new project and then type in here the title of your script you want to write look for the industry this script is about automotive which is cars so if you are doing health you should know what to write here and then Click on SEO keyword because that is what is going to land you on the search term you want people to find you on YouTube. Wait. Cheap luxury cars, it's pretty okay for me. And I click on next. And what this content writing software does, which most of the content writing softwares don't do, is giving you the SEO score of every title, phrase, or sentence you write. Watch this. Here on the right hand side, it has given me the SEO score for this title and it has generated several other titles for my title I wrote there. Here it says, 5 luxury cars you can buy on a budget in 2022. 82 is pretty good. And then it is telling me the kind of people who are interested in this kind of title. Mostly male and their ages are between 13 and 65. But the peak is about 35 to 44 years. I just have to continue by selecting which one I want. Make sure you select by how high the score is and how catchy the title also is. Click on next. So now it has generated outlines for me. I just have to continue like that. Here it has given me the intro paragraph. And most of its intro paragraphs are very, very attention grabbing. And then pick which one you think it's good. Considering the SEO score. Click here. Then next. The rest is for it to write all the outline it has written here. So click on generate. And here generate, 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 generate. And you are done with everything you are doing. So it will generate almost everything. If you think that part of the outline is pretty short, you can click on continue for it to keep writing. Now, when you are done with all click on copy the copy icon here then you can send the whole thing to wherever you want to make your voiceover this also works so well for all blogs you can try it yourself so i want everyone watching this video to try it i mean it's free for seven days you can try it out if you don't like it fine but then you should try it out use it and see how well it works there is a link in the description box below for this software and if you want to buy it right away i have 20 percent discount for you kindly click on the link and then the 20 percent discount code will also be in the description box below 
Here in this session, we are going to use a software called Audacity to perfect our text-to-speech audio. As a result, we are going to go through six simple steps to make this achievable. But before, you have to download Audacity. Audacity is a free audio editing software. You don't have to pay anything. So the first thing you have to do is to download Audacity and after installation, open it. I have a couple of projects done here, which I'm going to skip for the sake of our project. Click on OK. Now, this is how Audacity looks like. Quickly, we are going to import the audio we are going to use for this, which is our text-to-speech audio from Voicely. In order to import, go to File and click on Import Audio. You can search through to find where your audio is. Another way to import your audio is to simply drag and drop it in. It's pretty simple. Remember, whenever you want to apply any effect to your audio track, first thing you have to do is select the whole audio track. You use Ctrl A to select the whole audio track. Go to Effects, and the first effect we are going to apply to is EQ. Now move through and search for Filter Curve EQ. Here in Filter Curve EQ, the first thing we are going to apply to our audio is Bass Boost. So click here, Factory Preset, and then Bass Boost. Now you click on OK to apply. I think at least it has changed the, the voice a bit. Luxury cars you'll love. These cars have everything you could ask for in luxury vehicles, like leather seats, surround sound. So our audio has become much more deeper. The next effect we are going to apply to this, which is also an EQ effect, is to go to Effect again, Filter Curve EQ, Manage again, Factory Preset, and this time Treble Boost. Click on OK to apply. Now let's listen to it. Have everything you could ask for in luxury vehicles, like leather seats, surround sound, and more. Our audio has now got a bit of highs. The next effect we are going to apply to this is normalize. Control A again to select it. Go to effect. Now search for amplify. Here in amplify, make sure that the new peak amplitude is always zero zero when you are doing this. Click on OK. Our third effect is a compressor effect. So go to Effect again, search for compressor, click on it. And this is my preset for this audio. Usually you have the software's default compressor settings, which is 12 here, 8040, here 2 is to 1, and here 0 0.2 and 1.0. But in our case, we are going to use 5.1 here, and here we're going to use negative 50, and here negative 30 be okay for our project now let's listen to it one again buy an expensive car but don't want to spend beyond your means here are five cheap luxury cars you'll love i think our sound has been a bit better than before now this time we have to normalize it again so go to effect again amplify get a new peak amplitude to negative theory Click on OK. Can you see that it has reduced the height of the sound wave we see here? Now let's listen to it again. An expensive car but don't want to spend beyond your means. Here are five cheap luxury cars you'll love. I think it's better than before. The bass was dominating during the time it hasn't yet been applied. Our fit effect is hard limit. In order to apply the hard limit, Click on Ctrl A as usual, go to Effects, and down here, search for Limiter. Here's the Limiter, click, and look for a hard limit and click on it. With the hard limit, you are kind of limiting how hard the voice is to make it a bit softer for the hearer. Now click on OK. Our set effect is to apply an echo to the whole thing. So we click on Effect again, go to echo. Here with the echo, I would like you to leave it at 0 0.05 and 0 0.1. Yours may not be there, but you should change it to it to at least give the sound a bit of 
an echo to make it more of like a natural voice rather than a too hard voice. We have applied all that we need to apply to our audio. I think now our audio is pretty much better than before. So let's click here to, I mean, play and see how it sounds this time. If you're looking to buy an expensive car but don't want to spend beyond your means, here are five cheap luxury cars you'll love. These cars have everything you could ask for in luxury vehicles, like leather seats, surround sound, and more, all at affordable prices that won't break the bank. I think it's pretty good. So this was a sound I used for the video you watched in the beginning of the video. So it's mind-blowing if you can make much out of your text-to-speech audio when you want to use it for your videos voiceover. So if you want to download this onto your computer to use it for your video or any other thing you want to use it for, go up here to File, Export, and here you have the option to export it to either MP3, WAV, or AUG. These are the main three formats you can convert or export your audio into. So because I'm going to use an online software to edit my video, and I'm not too sure whether it can accommodate WAV, I would choose MP3 because it's the most common audio format almost all video editing softwares are set. Come here and click on save. And this part is not too necessary you can click on okay now here's how i made my video i used a software called clipchamp with clipchamp it is completely free if you want to i mean create your own videos without using their stock videos and audios i just imported videos i had downloaded from pixels and pixabay based on what the voiceover says i just pasted the videos and pictures and then added some background music which i downloaded from youtube audio library and then i added some few texts effects and other things which they had in there so you can try it yourself it's completely free but if you want to make youtube videos with ai softwares kindly click on the like button and the subscribe button and make sure you toggle the bell to get a notification whenever we release our new video and this is what we do these videos are going to help you to go on youtube and start making a huge ton of money without even working for long hours and one thing you have to remember is that i have included all the links to the websites and softwares used in this video in the description box below so kindly do well to check it out more especially the text-to-speech software and the script writing software it is a useful and a handy thing one has to get so try as much as you can to try them out with a script writing software. Even if you are not ready to purchase it, please do well to try it out. I have links in the description box below. Did you see the lady that was questioning me so much? Do you know how I created her? I used a software called AI Studio. Kindly check it out in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the other one.